everybody and welcome back to my channel and also welcome to the first haul video of this spring. How exciting! And I say first haul video of this spring because I'm sure, 100% sure, that there's going to be coming a lot more this spring. This year in May actually, end of May, I'm going to Portugal to the Algarve coast with my boyfriend and then also later in the year we are going to Mauritius with his family which is crazy. But in that occasion I'm going to be shopping a lot for summer clothes, bikinis, sunglasses, sandals, all that good stuff and of course I'm gonna throw it all into haul videos along the way. So if you want to be sure that you don't miss those then subscribe to my channel or you can follow me on Instagram at Hey Eugenia, where I always post pictures of all the stuff that I get and all the stuff that I am excited about. Now why don't we just cut all the talking around and get straight into my first spring 2016 haul video. Appropriately enough, I always tend to start out all of my haul videos by talking about the stuff that I'm already wearing. And you might have seen this shirt before, so this is nothing new. But these necklaces I just picked up the other day actually. So the other day I was in H&M and I was trying out a bunch of stuff that I found interesting. I always do that where I gather up in my mind everything that I like because I work in H&M every day. So I get so many ideas and I see so many pieces that I think I will like and that I want to buy. But I just don't buy it and I don't try it on until I have a day off where I can just try out everything and then I have to only pick a few pieces because obviously I cannot buy like 20 different pieces of clothing. So that way I limit the amount that I spend which is helpful for me because I have to pay rent, I have to buy food, I can't spend my whole paycheck on clothes even though I really wish I could really wish I could. So I was in the H&M and I was buying a bunch of clothes and I thought to myself like what are you gonna pair this with? If you just wear a regular t-shirt or a regular top it's gonna look really boring. So I thought I would look a little bit at the jewelry section and I found these two necklaces. They are gold and on a short chain because that's the way I like my necklaces. And I thought I'd go for two necklaces to pair them together to create kind of a more messy impression, which is the look that I like. It's just a little dainty ring on a chain, and then it's also a dream catcher. These are the two that I went for, and I think they're really cute, and I could wear them separately too if I wanted to. Let's get into the clothing section and the main section of this video. I'm gonna start out with the tops that I've been buying, and they are all all of this clothing is from H&M, which I think is no surprise since I work there. And the first piece I'm going to show you is something that you can combine with these necklaces and it's also one of my favorite pieces. It's this lacy... I don't know if you would call it lace, but it's see-through. It has like a pattern to it and then it has these beautiful bell sleeves that cut right at the elbow and it looks so girly and so flirty. I love the look of this. It's something completely different from what I would normally wear of like a shape of a blouse but it's so pretty and I usually wear a bandeau bra underneath and it looks great. The next piece is something I bought on the same day that I bought the other shirt and it is something completely crazy and different for me but I love it. I mean it has the perfect color that I really like, like the half turtleneck. I don't like the full turtleneck, I feel like I'm being choked. It's just a little too much for me, but this is perfect and it gives a great look. And it also has these like three quarter length sleeves that are kind of loose. This is a piece that you cannot really get an impression of unless you see how it looks on. So I think it's better if we go directly to the try on part so you can see why I like this. Because maybe when I'm holding it up like this you're like, what? Seriously? But seriously. The next thing I bought is a regular old t-shirt, but it's actually not so regular. It's really long in the back and it's also really long in the front, but it's longer in the back. And it has a huge slit all up the sides, on both sides. You can see this. I don't know, it's just a great easy piece to wear to work or to wear like on a casual day where you still want to look cool. This is from the Divided Grey line at H&M. If you want to look specifically for it, it's much easier to find probably. You don't sweat a lot in this, which is cool. Recently 
a tragic event happened here in my house. I broke my favorite pair of pants. I know, it's horrific. And I was actually wearing them to work one day and I already noticed that there were like holes in the crotch area. I don't know if this is TMI, but anyway, they were like worn out. I wore them so much that the fabric had gone thin and there were little holes in the pants and I thought yeah yeah nobody's gonna look there I mean you can still wear the pants but then I was at work and I was picking something up from the floor I was bending down and they ripped they ripped so hard and you could hear it so I had to throw them out I had to give up on those pants so naturally I had to buy new pants and they will never replace my old pants but I still like them anyway so let's see what pants I picked out first pair is from H&M obviously and they are these dark wash like coil dark gray jeans with rips on the knees and also the cut off like cuts at the ankle like cut off the edge like ripped style I don't know how to describe it but it looks cool and edgy and I love that and in the back they don't have any pockets which is something I have to get used to because I don't like my ass to be so exposed but that's the new life I guess they are very high-waisted, which is what I look for, because when I'm at work or any type of thing during the day, I, like, I just bend down a lot, pick stuff up off the floor, you sit on a chair. I don't like to pull up my pants a lot, and I don't like the feeling of a breeze running over my lower back, and I feel like my ass is showing. I don't like that. So I love high-waisted. So much more comfortable to wear. So these are my new pants. of pants are disco pants as I like to call them because I once saw Soella wear these kinds of pants like disco pants they're black but they're shiny black and they are very stretchy they're very high-waisted and they are great they're very comfortable and they look really like Cool, and they look really like fancy which I love I love these pants they are black pants they are high-waisted they are stretchy they fit nicely they also don't have any pockets which is a challenge but I'm gonna have to learn to live with it and I've been looking at them for a long time and then they were on sale and I was like yes 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 I'm getting them clothing out of the way that was actually all of the clothing that I've been buying I haven't bought a lot yet but I'm saving up for the summer clothes that will be arriving soon but I also bought a pair of shoes that I thought I would show you now I was looking for a kind of pair of shoes that were not sneakers a little bit more fancy and that I could wear a fancy shirt with but that would still be comfortable enough to wear to work during a nine hour shift that was like a challenge to find but eventually I ended up picking these from Deichmann I know you have that in different European countries they are from the brand Graceland and they are very affordable and they are very cute I love the heel like the bottom part of this shoe with like the cream color and then the edge of brown contrasting to the black I don't know they look really cool and they're still comfortable enough they're just a step up from sneakers so for the last section of this video I'm gonna wrap it up with some new beauty stuff not a lot just two so I bought a new concealer of the one that I'm already using it's the Rimmel wake me up concealer this is a great one and I haven't wanted to try a different brand or a different type of concealer because this really works for me and the last and final thing that i bought is a new fragrance or a new smell of the batiste dry shampoo and this is awesome i love the scent of this it's the bright and lively floral essences and this is everything that i could ever want in a scent i wish i could find a perfume that smelled like this if you know of any Please write me in the comments. Please let me know if I can find any type of perfume that has a similar scent to this Because this is amazing. My hair life consists of dry shampoo Because it's great and if you thought that this video was great, then I'm really happy because that's the point Yeah, I don't know how to end this video now, but I'm just gonna say goodbye and I hope you had a wonderful day I hope you did enjoy this video 
And I hope you look forward to much more hauls, because I do. And let me know in the comments what was your favorite piece of everything that I showed you in this video. And then I'll see you in my next video next week. Bye!